What's going on, you guys? AJ Turkey here with AJ Self Defense, man. I want to circle back to the fentanyl crisis, man. This latest story, Aaron Broussard, 32 years old of Hopkins, Minnesota, was convicted in March of distributing controlled substances, including fentanyl, resulting in 11 deaths with people in 2016, including University of Minnesota professor Jason Bedall, who was found dead in his office off campus, I mean. Another four victims survived the overdose but suffered serious bodily injuries. And this dude was just tripping. He was going crazy. I'm going to skip this story here. But basically, 11 people died. He had a website called plantfoodusa.net um, under the guise of selling plant food. In March of 2016, he placed a drug order for 100 grams of 4FA, a knockoff form of Adderall, to be shipped from a China-based drug supplier. But the package really contained 100 grams of 99% pure fentanyl, which Broussard claimed he was not aware of when he shipped orders. But the problem is when people start dying and people start getting sick um, and things of that nature, he kept selling. He didn't give anybody any warnings. He just circled back to the uh, the supplier in China and he requested a discount. He was, you know, so basically he probably said, hey, man, y'all killing fools. Uh, give me a discount on this one. So, you know, it, and it's just crazy, man. So this well, a little bit of fentanyl, man, just a little bit of fentanyl will kill you. And if you can see this picture right here, this right here is a lethal dose. There's a penny. There's how much uh, heroin that will kill you. And then that's how much fentanyl will kill you. And and kids are dropping like flies as well because, you know, as a kid, you're going to try something. When I was a kid, uh, you know, I knew kid that tried drugs. When I was in college, you know, I, I smoked marijuana. Like I, I experimented with a few times, right? But now kids are just popping pills here and there and they can get their hands on them. But if a pill has a little bit of fentanyl in it, it will take you out all the way out. There is no there is no mistakes made. There is no chances. You get one chance and it's over with, man. And so this this man is getting life in prison. But there is a lot out there, man. So fentanyl is, is becoming the number one killer uh, in the United States, probably in other countries as well. I'm not too much worried about the other countries, man. I can, I just got to focus on where I'm at. But keep your head on the swivel, man, and just watch out. So it's not just kids dying from fentanyl. It's adults, you know, getting on sites and ordering stuff like Adderall or things, things that they need to try to get through the next day. And all of a sudden, it's laced with fentanyl, man. So you got to make sure what you get is legit. You can't just be going on these sites as well. And then whenever I say stuff like that, people get mad and say, oh, you you can't blame the victims and this and that. Hey, I'm a safety channel, man. I'm talking about this safety. Lock your doors, keep your head on the swivel, and be careful what you put in your body. That's, that's my message. That's all I got for this one, man. I'll see you on the next one.